What is up and it's going on guys, Simpsy here and welcome back to another episode of my Romus Rectum 2 Roman campaign. Now let's get straight and right into it. Um a couple of things have happened. Um just looking at Northern Africa, Carthago is not really too happy. And you might be thinking, what the hell are my armies? Well, they're actually besieging this settlement. I have skipped a couple of turns ahead, which I usually do. Do, do. Um, but uh, we're actually besieging this Carthage settlement. And I do know there's another Carthage settlement there. And they're not very well garrisoned. So we're actually going to take two Carthage settlements in quite quick succession. Um, so I'm going to auto-resolve this battle here. Got this settlement off him. Uh, we're gonna. Hmm. There's not many troops there, is there? I mean, the population. Yeah. Might as well enslave. Doesn't really do much. So we'll leave these guys here and we'll actually swing around Gannicus, Sini, Sin, Sinitius. I, I don't know. I can't even bother looking at it, how to pronounce it. So we'll attack this. We'll attack the Carthage capital and. There's not many people in there. I think we'll just auto-resolve this one and take the, uh, their last settlement over to the west that they've got boarding with the Glacey. Okay, so let's auto-resolve that. And I uh, will definitely depopulate. What? Nation destroyed? Did the... Did the Glacey take that settlement? I thought there was a settlement around about here. Fucking hell, I would have played that battle then if I knew it was the last... Ah, oh, shit. Oh, well. That's, that's, damn, that's shit luck. Um, we can, I guess we can repair in these settlements and, uh, get ready to, uh, put the Carthage under, well, the car, the last of the Carthage settlements under Roman protection, but... That's rather interesting. How old is Spurus? 51 years old. So now all these rebelled. Oh no. Now there's... <laughs> there's two full stacks here. Okay, that's not too bad. Um, I am recruiting in Rome. We're recruiting a lot of... Uh, nine years of uh, cohort. I also have some Celtic Warband. Uh, three... Six stacks of Celtic Warband. And he's going to be under the command of... Manus Marcellus. Now, let's have a look at the north here. We've got a fairly big army in Batavium. I did build another fort. I can't remember if I did show that last episode. So we have a pretty strong garrison there. We have a full stack. And I've actually given the command to Spurus, uh, Spurus Archius. And, uh... I don't know. He's, uh... It was... He's... He's not very good governor. And, uh, he's young. Mind you, he's not really young. <laughs> I didn't mean, I didn't, I didn't think he was that old. He's 52 years old. Basically, um, he wasn't really good, any worth having in any settlements. So, um, I just had him kind of sitting in and around here, if you can remember. So, I finally found some use to him, and he's the commander of the fort. We have a weaker garrison there from the Roman rebels. Um, they actually came in and attacked Genoa. Um, I didn't end up showing that because I was just skipping through doing all the auto management and stuff. Um, they actually attacked Genoa, which was crushed rather quickly. Um, let's have a look down in Spain, I mean Sicily. What the fuck? I thought I saw something. Oh my god. I'm stunned. They brought Sparta has actually flew over the channel and uh Attacked us. We're allies. I thought they were allies, allies with Macedon. No, but they're enemies with them. Shit, that's not good. Um, I am recruiting there. I guess I can recruit a couple. Well, oh. maybe we can send that cohort down there just to garrison Tarentum a bit. Well, never fear, we do have a full stack being recruited. Well, close enough. That can be sent down. And we actually have a commander. Instead of sending him... I, I didn't really have a specific destination for my cellars here. I was either going to send him up north, depending if the barbarians attack. Um, We haven't lost many more generals now from the assassinations, because my, my assassin's actually pretty much taken all the assassins out of Italy, but there's still one there. I might just give him around uh, this Alvani. Uh, 
Ah, uh, Vanny. Settlement just to kind of knock off some people. Um, hmm. I think I might need to send some troops back. Because we have too many. Because, uh... Carthage isn't really too happy. So, um, I think I'm going to send... Can I send Spurious back? No, they're not really too happy about that. Oh, no, that's not too bad. We'll send... Hmm. We probably want to leave a stronger a force here just because we're bordering with the treacherous Spanish here. So they must have taken... Well, they, I knew for a fact they took Tingi, but... Now, isn't that a turn of events? Us... Uh, probably going to war with the uh, the uh, Galaci in uh, Northern Africa. That's really <laughs> interesting. Well, we'll send this guy back to Carthage. Whoa! Or well, we could just get attacked by... Yeah, there's going to be so many Carthage rebels in and around here, which is going to be shit. Um, I guess we'll do the exact same thing. We'll leave... We'll leave four... Uh, probably not our best, actually. Two lots of archers and a lot of cav. And that should be pretty well right. Oh, that's on a low taxation as well. What's the populace? 3,000. Oh, there's a bloody Galaci assassin there, which uh, we might want to get him out of. I think I might actually leave a lot of Triarii just in there. But we'll move this army back. We'll get it to rally up with uh, Spurus here. Uh, who do we have? We have Titus uh, Scipio here. Oh, yeah, actually helps the populace. <clears throat> I probably need to send some more governors down to, uh, to, uh, Carthage, because we got Hoblus Tenius Marcella here. No. Because we really, we have a really good general in Syracuse. Can't really move him out. Who's this? Um, okay. Well, we're going to have to deal with the Spartans invading, so I, I would imagine that they are going to attack Tarentum, but we're going to have to see. This is fucking interesting. The first time. It's just so shit. We're being attacked by so many people. It's just ridiculous. And every time we... Yeah. Every time we seem to expand, we either get pushed back or <laughs> some shit happens. Um, but at least we got rid of Carthage now. There's no more Carthage in the world. Which is, uh, good. We finally got rid of the fuckers. Um, okay. National announcements. You've got to be kidding me. As I said, there's been, like, hardly any family members dead. We just lost Tegula. And he was, yeah, far out. He was actually a really good general. Well, actually, his son's going to come of age, so we might send him up there. Or declared Roman Sparta. That means Marcus's son must have come of age nearly soon. Yeah, he's 14. Titus is 12. Publius is 5. And Decimus is 2. Okay. We have our spy here. Maybe we can get some... Damn it. Payback. We'll, we'll have a crack at this family member. Miss Target. He's probably not not quite good enough going after general, so. How much money do we have? A little bit more. Well, we do need to raise this army so and uh, send it down to Tarentum. So we'll rally up in Rome. And uh, put them in there. This might not be enough, but I, I reckon we're going to lose Tarentum. Um, we probably can't get down there quick enough. But we are going to be sending a force to hopefully retake it. We do have Ballista there. I don't know what I want to do exactly regards to um, our next kind of plan. Um, I guess... Well, it, before, before this Spartan army actually marched down, what have they even got? Spartan. Oh, they look cool. They look really cool. Um, whether or not... I don't know. The plan was originally to... Uh, we need to settle Carthage a bit better because it's a little bit... Yeah, look at that. Everyone's pretty unrest. 
restless. I'm actually gonna move everyone out through Carthage. Um, we kind of need to settle Carthage down because the populace is a little bit unhappy, obviously because we've just taken over their territory. But after that, I was probably gonna. The plan was to originally go uh, west, take out the uh, Galaci settlements here, probably take out Tingi and uh, Gadiro. But I don't think we're gonna do that just yet. Uh, I definitely don't want to move. On actually start the invasion probably until I probably have it. I would roughly be comfortable with five stacks. Um, I reckon that's how we're gonna do it. But mind you, we do have a we do need to keep a strong military force to the north. We probably have we got one stack between that fort and Patavium, and we definitely do have a full stack in there. Yeah, we probably got two stacks to the north. We do have this other army here. I think I might just try defending, uh, defending the territories that are conquered and try to, instead of uh, expanding too quickly. We do have a ceasefire with the Galaxy, so none of them will come into our territory. We do need to deal with a lot of rebels in and around Rome. So I reckon main main focus will be throwing back Sparta, which hopefully we we should do with ease. Um, I don't really see why there'd be much more trouble. So uh, we'll move. We're going to spread our forces between these three Carthage, uh, <clears throat> these three settlements in northern Africa. Can we actually increase the taxes? Yeah, but not too much. And the settlements we just took are pretty well right on their own. Uh, I probably actually left them a little bit under defended. But once the retraining comes, we should be all right. How are we going in Polantia? Polantia. Polantia. I don't know. I say it with a name. Fuck knows. Um, I do have these ships here, though. I was going to send them to cut off any Spartan ships. Um, but I think they're pretty well gone, so they can't get off Italy. Obviously, have some more troops coming. We're just gonna have to end turn. That turn did take a long time. Now I think about it, I did crap on for a little, a little too long. Um, hmm. Okay. City expands. Ah, speaking of Palantia. Uh, we don't really have enough money. I guess we can make a Roman Opidium. National announcements. Okay. Structure report. Alliance announced. Roman rebels in the Galaci. Really? So now that actually hasn't worked to my advantage because the Roman rebels here, their allies with the Arvini. Yeah, their allies with Gaul and what's so. So they've actually rallied with me. So that's just another lot of enemies. They did fight them for a while, but. Damn it. Oh, we'll just have to take them back. Um, are they still besieging Tarentum? They are too. There's not really too much we can do. Can we get there in time? The thing is, who who is in there? Decimus Longus. Do I really want to save him, or I would rather... I'm, whoa, 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 whoa. Now that's interesting. Fucking perfect time. Roman rebels have come down to attack Genoa. So, looks like we're going to be moving these guys to the north instead of uh, moving them down south. So we're actually... Fuck, that was a really stupid idea. Oh my god. Roman Serectum 2 controls. God damn you. <laughs> um, I guess we'll just send a lot of cohort from Batavium, just, just so they can't take it in one turn. That would be embarrassing. Um, yeah, we're going to send them down. Um, but the thing is, do we have enough troops? I, I, don't, I don't think this army could contend with that Spartan host. And it might be better for us, for them to actually take the settlement so they we can kind of block off their expansion. Um... I don't really want to take troops out of Northern Africa. Hmm.
We could fight them on the field if they came at us, but... What have they got? Are these guys any good? They've just got a lot of phalanx. You know what? Fuck it. Oh, wow. Well, we're going to have to... Put... We'll get rid of these rebels. Even though we lost a lot of our troops, but... Oh, well. We can actually get troops into the settlement. I did forget about that. We could do that. Yeah, I might do that then. Put them in the settlement and then we get to fight them in the city, which would probably have us have the advantage. How long can I for six turns? And we can get some reinforcements. We can send Longus back back north. We'll send him to Rome. And we'll get him to uh, send more troops down. How old is... How old is Marcus Maximus? He's 55 years old. Um, he's a bit of a shit dude. <laughs> he's not really one of the lads, is he? Um, well, his son comes of age very shortly. So um, we'll have to say... Oh, here we go. Now, the Gauls have been doing this a lot. Oh, what a... This is this campaign is going to be the death of me. The, <laughs> I've never had, like, just so many people at war with me. It's ridiculous. It's so much fun, though. It actually is. It's just so different to all my other campaigns. Like, I don't think I've actually played a campaign and lost. Um, which this very more might be. Because every time we get something good or something good is going along, just something just comes and slaps us in the face. It's just ugh, not good. Well, first things first, we're going to throw back these Roman rebels. Because they're starting to give me the shits. We're going to leave this stronger garrison in Genoa. Um, the goals... How long does this hold out for? Three turns. Well, things are not being besieged. We haven't actually, they keep on going through that way, aren't they? So probably going to need to build another fort there, but... I don't know. I guess we could kill some of their generals to get some payback. 40%? No way, that's not going to happen. 90. 3%. I'm happy with that. Just trying to get his level up so we can take on some bigger targets next time. He's, no, he's 40 years old. He's still kind of young. Um, we do have a lot of money. How old is Decimus' son? Uh, Spurus' son, sorry. Populus Tegula. He's 15. He still hasn't come of age, really. Okay. Um, we do need to quell the situation in Rome. So I'm just, I was thinking whether or not to buy more troops. Or um, build more on the economy. I think I want to wait for them to attack me, so... And we can get more reinforcements down. Okay, let's go back down to uh, Northern Africa. Now, we're being attacked here. Fucking Galassi. I probably should have left a stronger problem, uh, uh, garrison back in there, but shit happens, I guess. Um... Probably gonna have to leave him in there. Actually, I might get Spurus to go there because. Ah, oh, fucking Carthage is now pissed off. I think it was the things I built um, that real anger really hankered them. Um, we don't have enough money to like quell the situation and build some better buildings for them. So ah, oh, the fucking Galicia have got us again. We could take out, uh, would this be enough? If we attack them with this army, we'll be able to, probably not be able to throw them back. <sighs> That's pissed me off, that has. We're just getting attacked on so many fronts. We're getting attacked in the north, in the south, when we try to expand in Africa. We get attacked by the Galaci. Ow, oh, the Dacia, I want to have a talk to you. We're going to attack me as well. 
I don't want to complain because people don't like people complaining, but um. Marcus Marcellus, of course. Just to throw another spanner in the works. And, oh, you've got to be kidding me. Sparta has brought up another army. Okay, uh, I'm going to destroy that fleet utterly. Damn it. National announcements. Populus Tegula came of age. That's good. Disdains from his father. That's not good. Because his father was a rather good general. From what I can remember. Decius Fabius Maximus takes after his father. No! God damn it! Why would you have to do that? Uh, your father wasn't a very good man. Well, we do need to make him the heir because he is technically the heir. And I, don't, I do not know how long until Marcus's reign kind of continues. But... At the moment, he's still 16 years of age, so uh, we don't know what type of faction leader he's going to be just as yet. Well, Tegula has always been up in the north. His father was up in the north, and I would imagine he would have been there from time to time. Um, goal. Goal, 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 goal. Six to seven. Okay, we're going to have to recruit in Rome again. Um, I think we're going to have to fall back from these settlements as well. I'm actually going to sack the city. Because um, if we move any troops out of Carthage, Harad, Haraduntum, Had Rum Entum, or Thapas. They're going to quell the situation. That's... Oh... Hey guys, just before I leave you today, I would like to go and please follow me on Twitter. It's the best way to interact with me. If you've got any questions at all, message me on Twitter and I reply to absolutely everything. On there you'll be able to see Let's Plays coming up, when I've posted a video, and all that good stuff. So uh, also, if you'd like to subscribe to get all the recent up-to-date content on my channel. So, bye guys.